Hi everyone, I'm starting a new bullet journal today and I want to bring you along for the first few spreads. All of the products that I'm using today, I'll make sure to have links in the description down below. For my cover page, I wanted it to be minimalistic, but I wanted a hint of color. So for my theme, I went with blue, yellow, and pink. I outlined a circle around the year and I decided that I wanted some sort of plant so I drew some leaves around the border of that. I decided that I wanted a little bit more on the page so I outlined some stars all around the circle. One of the reasons why I wanted to start a bullet journal was because I want to work on my lettering and my numbers because I am so bad at numbers. I really have been interested in calligraphy lately, so I really want to work on that this year. I'm just going in with my Tombow brush pens with pink, blue, and yellow to fill in the stars. Like I said, I'm terrible at numbers, so I decided to print off the calendars for the spread until I get better at making my numbers smaller. I'm using the Tombow adhesive to stick the calendars to the page. This was my first time working with these markers and I really enjoyed working with them. I would say they are worth to buy even though they're a little bit pricey. I just used my Pilot Precise V5 pen to write out the months above the calendars. For the next page, I decided to do a quote and I found this quote online and it stuck out to me because I thought that it was really important because people feel like their lives are on a timeline and they're supposed to do things a certain way and I feel that people can do anything they want when they feel it's right.
With everything going on right now with all this uncertainty, I always like to just come back to art to feel relaxed and just to feel better about life in general. And I'm so glad to start this new journey and bring you guys along with me. To bring color to this page, I decided to write the word timing in yellow and outline it with the micron pen. For the next page, I decided that it would be my goals page. So I just typed up goals and printed it off on this blue scrap paper. I separated the page in two columns, one for realistic goals and the other one for dreams. For the next page, I decided that it would be YouTube ideas. So I broke it up into three groups. I made a section for my journal, a section for painting, and a section for drawing. For my last spread, I made it things to check out and I broke it up into three columns, a section for books, TV shows, and movies. If you guys like the video, give a thumbs up, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And thank you for watching.